Oh my gosh. Hey everybody. Happy Monday. That's um, a new one. I was saying, oh the things goodness. that happened right before we hit the live button. <laughs> I'm telling you, whatever. So, oh, hello everyone. Make sure you guys are saying hello and let us know where you are watching from. We are coming to you from beautiful, cool California. It rained. Day. It, it rained, it rained all day yesterday, yesterday yep. on Mark's day to golf. So he was not very happy. He was, My clubs were in the garage crying. <laughs> he was very sad. We have not had any rain and it rains on the day he wants to play golf. But today it's beautiful. It's cool. It's going to be a great day to go out and have a walk. So make sure you guys say hello. If you are catching the replay, which means that red box up there is not showing, we missed you. Please put missed you in the comments. And then also, if you are new, welcome. Super excited that you found your way to our page. Please put new in the comments so I can properly introduce ourselves. But for now, my name is Renee. I'm Mark. And we are Team Terry. Jackie Fisher, or Jackie Flessner. Thank you so much for saying hello so I can see that the comments are working. Make Yay. sure you guys say hey so we're not talking to ourselves. Do us a favor. We love to be able to reach more people, help them with easy recipes that are healthy. This one is like a Whole30 recipe, you guys. It's super simple, very healthy, and easy. Yep. Make sure that you guys share this with somebody that you love. So share it out. Put share it in the comments. We'll get you entered into a drawing. And the last thing before I zip it and we make this amazing spaghetti squash, I have to, I have to share. So I didn't even know I liked spaghetti squash until... One of our neighbors said, hey, I grew some extra. You guys want to do something with it? And Mark cooked it. And I thought, well, that's pretty good. Where's this been all my life? So make sure that you guys are following us for all things keto. Tap on she the screen. She grew up in the country. I did. <laughs> I did. So you guys, to follow us, I just like, I found somebody I was watching the other day and I wanted to follow. I always tell you guys to tap on the screen. And there'll be three dots up here at the top. I lie. Every time I lie. <laughs> Tap on the screen, and then right next to the title, there's three dots. And that you can select follow and turn on live notifications because you definitely don't want to miss this crazy show. <laughs> you definitely you don't. You're going to chuckle if nothing else. Exactly. So we're making crock pot spaghetti squash. I'm going to let you get started, and I'm going to go give some shares out. Okay. Be sure you check us out on YouTube, Team Terry Keto. Team Terry's one word. The T's are capital. I have no idea where my phone is. Thanks for playing with my butt. <laughs> We've got breakfast, lunch, dinner, um, appetizers, fat bombs, you name it. We've got hundreds of recipes over there to keep you on your journey. And uh, if you want the, the link for that, put YouTube in the comments and we'll get it to you. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, come check us out on Facebook at Team Terry Keto. Um, this is a real, real good um, meal prep uh, as well as, uh, as the... Uh, uh, weather starts to turn and it gets colder. Yes. This would be a real good, real good uh, lunch or dinner. Um, and doesn't take too long. Um, so let's get started. I started with uh, two pounds of ground turkey. You can certainly use ground beef. You can use ground chicken. You can use whatever you want. Um, I just browned it up on the, on the stove and um, Drained the uh, excess grease off of it, which there wasn't a whole lot because it is turkey. Um, but it's you, you want to be sure that it's fairly dry. You don't want to get real soggy. <clears throat> and then I'm just going to put that in my crock pot. I'm, I've got two tablespoons of Italian seasoning. I've got a teaspoon of salt. It's stuck to the... What the heck is this? It's stuck to my little container here. Huh? <laughs> what the heck is this? Is yeah. there moisture in the air? Hey Must guys, be. make sure you're saying hello as you are coming on. Hey Joanna, hey Carolyn, hey Donna, hey Jackie. Thank you guys for saying hello. I've got a half a teaspoon of pepper, uh, garlic powder, and onion powder. We're just going to mix all this up and we're going to throw this on top of our meat. Then I'm going to add to that a uh, can. It's a 28 ounce can of diced tomatoes that uh, I've drained. You Again, you don't want too much moisture in this. It's going to have some anyway because it's going to be covered and But we want a thick whatnot. sauce. Yeah. So I'm going to add the uh, tomatoes to the top of that. Spread those all out in here. And then we're going to add on top of that, um, we cut up some um, leftover peppers. We just dice those up. You can use whatever vegetables you like. 
You could probably put uh, broccoli in here, cauliflower, carrots, whatever you like. Uh, whatever you have in your refrigerator. Yeah. I told Mark, I said, can we add some peppers? You have peppers in the vegetable drawer and they're going to go bad. So that's what yeah. we did. That's what we did. So, and then that's, I've got that all in there. I'm just going to mix that all around. There's enough moisture with the tomatoes that it's, uh, it's going to mix together really well. Get all of those seasonings through the meat and the tomatoes and the peppers. And we'll get that all mixed together. And then I'm going to uh, have the uh, uh, spaghetti squash and clean the uh, seeds out of it. And then we're going to put that in there and put the... Uh, spaghetti squash in the crock pot to cook, you guys. So, hey, Marlene. Hey, Wanda. Hey, Alita, April, Colleen, Jackie, thank you guys all for saying hello. Jackie just said recipe. If you guys want the recipe, make sure you comment recipe and we will get you the link. I'm going to have it over at teamterryketo.com. Um, super, super simple. And I was sharing whenever we were first coming on that I didn't, I mean, this, my first time ever having spaghetti squash was probably a year ago. And literally it was a neighbor that brought a bunch of spaghetti squash and says, here, from my garden, do something with it. So... I mean, I absolutely love it. I love spaghetti squash. It's really good. Yes, it is. And there's, it, it's amazing how it, I mean, it's hard as a rock right now. Um, and it just, it's like a it pumpkin. takes a little bit. Yeah, it's it's firmer than a pumpkin even. Oh, and there's like little pumpkin seeds. Yeah, I've yeah. never even seen one, you guys. Can you eat them like pumpkin seeds? No. Oh, I was going to eat it. <laughs> oh, my oh, my gosh. I'm serious, you guys. This is like real life stories, okay? I, I just, I've never, I was never really a, Vegetable fan. Vegetable yeah. fan, exactly. That was kind of, yeah, that was yeah. putting it nice. This is, uh, yeah, we've, we have changed our diets A considerably with, with the keto. Um, and it's, I, I was never a big vegetable fan either. And I have found that I like a lot of vegetables when they're cooked properly. So, um, we okay, found so ways to make them we're getting, really good. We're getting tips already. So Marlene says you should cut it lengthwise. So, okay. No. We, th this recipe, it was cut the like like this. Just to sit in here, you'll see. Yeah. Um, and spaghetti squash, somebody said, do you let it sit for two days? Because normally if you let it sit two days, it's a little softer. Okay. We have had it out. Uh, it was out. Uh, we bought it Saturday. yesterday. Oh, but... you want shopping on Sunday in the rain? You want Saturday? Oh, it was Saturday. Yeah, yeah. so it has so been it two has days. Been two days. See? And it sits, who knows how long it was in the store. So. Okay, but that's okay. It's good to know. You can leave this out. Now, unlike avocados, which these days turn in one day. I don't know about you guys. Oh, my so. God. It's unbelievably quick. <laughs> it's super, super quick. So, hey, you guys, I see everybody jumping on. Thank you for jumping on. Marcus, just cleaning this out so we can get it in. If you guys are not receiving our meal plans, I know it's Monday, but Wednesday our meal plans go out. If this one, like, turns out really good, this will be one that we will put in there for seven day meal plans. If you already get it, do me a favor, put get it in the comments because I want to know if you're getting it. We're sending them out weekly to people who subscribe. Make sure you check your junk, okay? Because I emailed it. <laughs> did not go right. Check your junk email, okay? Because I emailed it to myself and I had to go check my junk email. It was in promotion, so I had to go find it because a lot of people are saying, hey, I'm not getting it. So check your junk, okay? That's where an A is. Um, and make sure that you're getting, if you're not getting it, put meal plan, and I will definitely get it to you guys. We are trying our best. This is like, I think, our 14th week of doing it. We are trying our best to make this amazing for you guys. Every week, we are doing two meals now because we're encouraging intermittent fasting. So we're doing two meals, and we are giving you all of the meals and then only giving you like five or six different recipes because sometimes it's overwhelming to have that many recipes and not know which ones. But every week you're going to get a different recipe that you can try for your family. Oh, perfect. Okay. Got it, got it. I love it. See, everybody is getting it. Good. Okay. Okay, so I've got the uh, squash in here. Um, we're going to cook this on high for about three hours. We'll take it out. Be very careful when you take it out because it will be extremely hot. Um, and then we're just going to scrape it off with a fork to make the uh, uh, spaghetti and then uh, mix it all up in there and we'll be ready for dinner. So I'll do a little video in here, you guys. You can just check back um, that of us taking it out and then I'll do a photo of it done. So basically after it's all out and mixed in, it's just going to be kind of like a casserole or a stew, right? Yeah. Kind of like a stew or a spaghetti pot for sure. Looks good. 
perfect. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love that. Okay, so I think that is it. If you guys yep. want the recipe, make sure that you put recipe. Oh, and do us a favor. If you get value from any of our videos, okay, guys, we want to know that we are doing the things to we help see. keep yeah. you guys just make a positive impact. That's what we want to do. We want to make a positive impact. We know whenever we first started trying to get healthy, we struggled. It was yo-yo. I mean, it yeah. was awful. And now we have found an easy way and we just want to share it so other people don't have to struggle. If you get value, put value in the comments for us. Smash on that love button and share it with somebody you love. It really helps us to reach more people. Yeah. I see a lot of people wanting the meal plan and the recipe. Definitely a recipe, you guys. Like I said, this is super simple and I think it's only three hours on hot. It's three Three hours on high, two to three hours on high, uh, four to six hours on low. Yes, so that's why we're on here at two o'clock in the afternoon in California, so we can eat at five tonight. So it's super simple. You can be go pick up the kids from school, drop off whatever you guys need to do, and still have dinner. So I think that's it. That's I feel it. like I forgot something, but it's Monday, and you know how that goes. So thank you guys so much. We hope you have an amazing rest of your week. We love and appreciate you guys. Thanks for spending some time with us. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.